15 yards away and it's added spice to what already was a very spicy the Zidane is going to choose but 4-3-3 three, three. there's Messi Suarez he's looking sharp tonight Messi Suarez brilliant run here from Sergio Roberto now Messi may have been offside Roberto wasn't Messi checks himself on there's a spare man at the far post and that man is Suarez and Suarez has scored the first goal of the Classico Coutinho Ramos always had him in his sights Casemiro Tony Kroos takes it brilliantly the German leaves Busquets behind Benzema goes right Ronaldo's always the first port of court Ronaldo enters the area with intent Tony Kroos goalkeeper's lost it Benzema Ronaldo Real Madrid back Ronaldo inspired Well, I said about Real Madrid sticking in there. This is the Real Madrid way of sticking in games. To get back forward, to get on the front foot. Sergio Roberto to Stegen. There's another incident off the ball here. And Marcelo is down. And the referee shows a straight red. Sergio Roberto dismissed recently against Celta de Vigo. There's see Sergio Roberto tries to run the ball out, he lays the ball off. Marcelo bumps into him, doesn't he? Sergio Roberto throws his arm up. How much does he make contact with Marcelo? Barcelona kicking off the second half. A man down. They said this was supposed to be the decaffeinated El Derby. El Gr have to be patient. And when they win the ball back, you can see the impact they're having on the counter-attack. It's Suarez to Lionel Messi. Messi draws the two defenders, gets over the challenge, and Lionel Messi against the odds gives Barcelona the lead. They're a man down, but maybe that doesn't matter when you have Messi on the field. Real Madrid will have to change their approach now. <laughs> Quite surprising to see Barcelona on the counter-attack. Real Madrid so exposed against ten men. And it is brave for Valverde. Any manager, when you have a player sent off and you're on level terms, to still keep the two attacking players on the pitch, up the pitch, looking to score goals, looking to win the game. It helps mind if one of them's Lionel Messi. Suarez does really well here. Tenacious play, there might be a claim from Real Madrid. That he has impeded Rafael Varane. Once he moves the ball on to Lionel Messi, we'll see him perfect touch, the perfect amount of touches. There's Busquets to Lionel Messi. Suarez finds Rakitic. Rakitic offside. <laughs> I'm not talking about in the future, I'm talking about in this particular match. <laughs> there goes Semedo, one of the substitutes. Paulinho's in there! Get out by MTT. Luis Suarez hits it long. It's into the slipstream of Messi. The goalkeeper decides to stay. Right decision. I didn't expect him for the, to go for the straightforward sprint, get there, takes a touch from that angle, tries to find the far post. I was, I was waiting for a dummy, dropping his shoulder. Lovely ball to Gareth Bale! Brilliant Bale! He needed one second to change the course of the game there. And now 11-man Real Madrid are equal against 10 men at Barcelona with 18 minutes to play. Well, I talked about Gareth Bale taking this game by the scruff of the neck because he has the quality, has the ability. Seeks Marcelo. Marcelo trying to keep a cool head. Marcelo is winning no friends in Barcelona. This it's lucky to be getting the equalising goal for Real Madrid because two bad challenges in the first half. That was a penalty. Yep. It's a slight miscontrol for Marcelo, which believes that Jordi Alba, makes Jordi Alba believe he's going to win the ball cleanly. Completely misses the ball. Makes a mistake. Messi gets around Ramos. <laughs> the pinch, putting Ramos under pressure. Forcing Ramos into a mistake. Oh. An air kick from Ramos. As his pocket is picked by Messi. Now he goes around Casemiro. And he tried to... <laughs> 
picks up the ball here. Rakitic threads it around Casemiro, gets the other side so easy. Looks to see where the support is and tries to beat the goalkeeper at the near post. That was in a mishit cross. He's trying with his right foot to beat Kayla now at his near post. It was Ramos taking out Rakitic. And the entertainment is complete. Between the managers, 